Hello everyone, welcome to Beauty in the Garden, I'm T. So in today's video, I'm gonna be planting up some Brussels sprouts. You guys, I killed almost all of my Brussels sprouts besides like maybe two or three. So I end up finding some beautiful Brussels sprouts at my local nursery. So if you can support your local nursery, it will help out your community. So I did purchase some Brussels sprouts and they're in very good shape. Um, they're right here. This is called the J Cross uh, Brussels sprouts and they are really nice shape, you guys, but they need to be watered because I was waiting to come out here and film and you guys, it is super hot outside right now. It is at least 90 degrees, okay? But that's what we're gonna be planting in today's video. So I hope you guys enjoy these types of videos and let's go ahead and jump into planting up these beautiful Brussels sprouts. So in today's video, we're gonna be planting these Brussels sprouts in a 30 gallon grow bag. So this grow bag is from Vivo Sun. So if you're interested in this particular grow bag, I will have all that information in the description box below if you guys are interested in purchasing this particular grow bag. Okay, you guys, so let's go ahead and get planting. First thing first, I'm gonna be putting in these posters right here. Now I did purchase these posters last year for a dollar, you guys. They are on sale right now at Walmart for I think like four bucks but they're running, they normally run about 11 to $10. I end up finding them for a dollar, but I am gonna be using these to support my Brussels sprouts. Okay, so now I have my post in and I'm going to show you guys what fertilizer I will be using for my Brussels. So I'm going to dig my hole as close to my post as possible. Now, I am gonna use the Jolt's Organic Vegetable and Tomato Fertilizer. You guys, this is my favorite. This is a 253 NP and K. I'm gonna put one tablespoon per hole. And as well, I'm going to use a blood meal. And this as well is from Job's Organic. Now this is just straight nitrogen. It is a 12. And I do have these you guys in the description box below as well. One tablespoon per hole. Now we do need our nitrogen for our plants. Uh, because we're planting up our leafy greens, we want a great source of nitrogen. If you cannot get your hands on the Job's Organic Blood Meal or any blood meal, uh, coffee grounds will work just as well, okay? And that is a great source of nitrogen. So we're going to give our soil a nice little toss. And we're just gonna give the bottom of our plants a nice little squeeze. Now I do recommend that you water these before planting them in. It will help, okay? But I'm just gonna go ahead and jump into it. Beautiful plants, right? Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and break it up a little bit because I see that it's almost root bound. If you guys can see there, I'm just gonna give it a little tease just like this. I'm gonna get as close to this post as possible. You 
you want nice sturdy plants. I will be planting it right up to here, okay? Right up to here is where I'm going to be getting that soil. And that would create a firm base for your plants. Okay, so we have our Brussels sprouts planted up and now I'm going to water them in. So right here I have my two gallon pitcher, okay? And I'm gonna put two tablespoons of the fish fertilizer in my two gallon pitcher. We're gonna give that a stir. Please stir this with a stick, you guys. And now I'm just gonna water them in. Make sure that you try your best to water at the base of your plant. at the end of the video we planted up our brussels sprouts so i hope you guys are getting that fall and winter garden ready guys we still have time to get it done so i hope you guys enjoyed the video please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up channel hit the notification bell so you can be notified when i do upload a video and come follow us on facebook instagram and on tiktok I would love to see you guys definitely on the Facebook group because I can get to see you guys beautiful gardens that you guys can share and I can see them. So I hope you guys really enjoy this type of content. Please watch the videos you guys all the way to the end and as well if you can share that will help out the platform as well. Remember there's beauty in everyone's garden and bye bye for now.